What is going on guys, Casual Savage here and in this video I'm going to be showing you an HD small file size render. Now just before I get into this video, if you'd like to request a tutorial, then be sure to leave it in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. So I have Sony Vegas open up right here and I'm going to drag on my intro. And as you'll see, the intro is 11 seconds long. So I'm going to right click properties to save, for example, uncheck maintain aspect ratio and OK. Now, I'm going to be showing you two ways in 720 or 1080, completely up to you which one you use. So come up to the project video properties. And from here where it says template, select this down arrow. And this is where you decide if you're going to render in 1080, then you'd come down and select this one right here, HD 1080 50i. If you want to render in 720, then you'd come to HDV 720 25p. Now it's up to you which one you pick. For this video, I'll only be picking the HDV 720 25p. Select that. And now your frame rate should be set to 25. And the full resolution rendering quality should also be set to best. From there, select apply and OK. Now double click on here. And now we're going to render it. So if we come to file, render as. Now my normal format is usually a WMV file and it would be this one right here. However, in this case we want a smaller file so it renders quicker and it uploads quicker. So in this case we're going to come to Sony AVC slash MVC MP4 M2 TS AVC. Select this down arrow and you will get this soon. But before we do that, you're going to be selecting Internet 1280 by 720 or Internet 1920 by 1080. This is depending which one you picked. So if you picked 1280 by 720 over here, then you're going to pick this one. But if you pick the 1080 one, then of course you're going to select this one. So we pick this one, of course. And then from here, you'd click Customize Template. And these are the settings you should see. Now, the first thing we need to do, where it says Profile, changes from High to Main. And then where it says the Frame Rate, we need to change this to 25 pal just like that now the bit rate will be set to 2 million so just simply put this in manually like that and then the audio stays the same the system stays the same and then the project we change video rendering quality to best and now come up here where it says template call this whatever you want to so you can call it what I called it which is HD small file render press this save icon and that way when you press this down arrow you can see it'll come up here, HD small file render. So I can now select that, press OK, and I won't have to remember them settings over again. I can simply come here and just render. So this is MP4, and we're gonna call this test one, and we're gonna put it up against WMV after. So here we go, render. And it's gonna begin to render. So it took 14 seconds to render that. Now we're gonna use the exact same project settings. This time we're gonna file render as as a WMV like I normally would. So I'm going to close out of the Sony ABC and I'm going to come down to my WMV and you'll see this is the one I would usually use. So I'm just going to customize template to make sure everything is the exact same settings I have just done. And everything seems to be the same. We've got to set this to best. Okay. And now we're going to render it and we'll see how long this one takes. You can see we're already at 10 seconds and it's just got halfway through. So you can see this one took 22 seconds, 8 seconds more than the Sony ABC. So as you'll see, this is what we've got. The MP4 one and the WMV one. So right click properties, this is the MP4. Right click properties, the WMV. And as you'll see, MP4 size 2.2 megabytes. WMV 6.19 megabytes. And if we come to details, details they're both at 25 frames per second just like that we've made the file size shorter and if we open up the video you might think there's a massive quality difference but as you'll see it still looks HD obviously you are losing a tiny bit of quality but it's not or barely noticeable so that was the mp4 and this is the WMV can you honestly see a difference to me I probably can't I really can't so uh, yeah, that is it. And that has given you a smaller HD file size right here, so WMV can go away. 
and this will also allow you to upload to YouTube quicker because the file size is smaller. Like I said at the start of the video, if you'd like to request a tutorial, then be sure to leave it in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. With that being said, be sure to go follow me on Twitter, I'll keep you updated when you post and what we're posting. Also be sure to go ahead and check out my gaming channel, I post four times a week. And finally check out my Snapchat, I'll just show you what I do throughout my day. So yeah, it's been Casual Savage here, thank you so much for watching, please subscribe, rate, and peace.